wishing you all well. Sending out of love to you as usual. We're starting early tonight. I think this might be a long one, to be honest. Nice night. Deep, deep, deep emotional stuff for me. Oh, my days. I weren't expecting that. Don't tell me. Me and the big man and the big man with a kiss of death to my nephew, Mason Carter. But life goes on. He's only a young kid. Never guy who's fighting. An Irish geezer. He was so different. He literally come to, he come with real, real purpose. But I know what happened in the camps. And they come, they some carters, they come with a game plan. It wasn't needed. Uncle Young says, just go hell forever. That K1 thing is a deep, there's, there's no room, because if you get a bad start, you're out. But yet, my nephew, while he was in serious trouble, he still managed to find a big one and put him on the floor. But by then, he got back up. He's, he's one of those lucky ones. But experience tells me that sometimes defeat can be the making of you. So better to get it in the early stages of your journey, I say. I remember, <laughs> I remember when I got my first defeat. <laughs> I was in, I went into spin keys from north, up north, right? He called me into the TV room. I had to go in. Everybody was listening. But when I got in there, I went rat -ta 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 -ta. I was winning. Everybody was in stunned disbelief and they were just, yeah, he quite young. And then I got a couple of fights. He was much, much bigger than me, right? Neil, always a pleasure, my Neil. What, what, what fight's that, Neil? What fight's that? Don't tell me I've missed this today with Tommy Fury. Is that, is that even happened now? I know Man United have won, right? But, I'm, Neil, let me tell you about last night. I said to you, when I got my first defeat, I didn't win even a loss, but I got a couple of fuds near the end after I threw the flurries in and I threw the kitchen sink in, but it was a massive geezer. Everybody was watching, right? And I got bruised, I got bruised on my lip of my eye. When I was down the block, I started crying. <laughs> I wasn't used to getting bruises. But you lie there and you think, bloody hell, it's a hurtful thing, man. When I was watching my nephew last night, all the big names were in there last night. All the big guns from way back in the day, business people now, proper people. I felt all the love. We big up Al Carter, my family. Neil, yeah, oi, but Neil, tell me Tommy's one. That's Tommy one. Come on, give me that one. Tommy's got a one. I know. I've just travelled back from Western Super Near, Western Super Mare. Uh, I'll just go get up to stop off here first before I get home because all the trains were all a bit mixed up. Please, Neil, tell me that. Right? But I was at Riverside last night, my first major event. Super like um, Saul said, like my man said, said, Uncle Yami, you're out and about. We're killing it. I'm bringing the, um, the artillery to the table this week with the interviews. Remember, I told you. Oh, it's tonight. Yeah, well, it ain't done yet. I knew that. It was nil. It ain't from what? Nah, I don't know. But Mason Carter, my nephew, right? I know, I know. We're off top form at the moment. <coughs> we I told you we're going to come from. We're going to break it all down tonight. Brian Cockle, everything. Uncle Yummy brings the facts to the table. You either listen or you don't. But still, you get your opinion that our time then, but it's been put out. Is it? Neil, tell me, it ain't. Tommy Fury deal with that, man. Tommy Fury deal with that. Trust me, trust me, trust me. Trust me, he can't lose that. If he lose that, then what, 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 what? Yeah, but Nick, Nick, what's that got to do with the grand scheme of things? That's not what I come up here to talk about. I ain't come up here to talk about the wallpaper, have I? You get me? Terrence, bump into Yami. Yes, Terrence, my boy. I love you too, Terrence. Big up for the family. You know the score, my boy. Yeah, yeah, whatever, man. Yeah. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I've got a nice lady down there. We'll see her now and again. Yeah. Terrence, you're right. Family, you're right. But anyway, I was screaming last night. It's too emotional, man. It went, it was a, listen, it was a five round thing, right? He had a bad start, my nephew. Knees and all that K1 and all that kind of stuff. There was a big crowd there. All the big names were there, trust me. But he's young, Mason. The other kids, them Irish lot, they're so tough, you know. You've got to be honest about all this. He come, the geezers lost a couple of fights, but the couple of fights he lost on points, the Irish geezer, in his last two fights, they were suspect. So I knew that it was going to be around. You heard Al Carter say it. You heard him, PJ Maguire say it. Yeah, I mean, yeah, but my man, it could be, we're a bit worried, but we still think 
because they're pushing my nephew through um, the ranks very, very quickly. That's up to them. They know the game better than me, right? But experience is going to matter in the end. They're nice on my boy. Yeah, my boy. Yeah, 100%. Right? So I'm thinking, I've, I've turned up tonight. The big man from Manchester, all the big men from all around the country that we talk about on my channel, they were there last night. It was deep, deep territory. They don't want their faces on the screen. Obviously, we know how this game goes. They will be on my podcast probably by the end of the year. Everyone that we've ever talked about, remember that I told you that. But Mason had a bad star. You know what I mean? Because they gave him the game plan to bob and weave because my man's got a brand new show. But yeah, Mason had a few problems, one, two, three rounds, but by the third and fourth round, you still managed, you had to dig deep, you dug deep like a lion, my nephew. He still put him on a penny, he put him on the floor, but it wasn't that, he was already, it's a hard task, all that wrestling and all that. Neil, okay, all right, let me know, let me know, all right? Yeah, all right, right, Kelly Davis, we love you, speed of recovery, um, get well soon, but he still found that big butt, so that tells me, that it's in there somewhere with a different plan. You know what I mean? Because he's only young. The other guy's about 10, 9, 10 years older. He's at pure battles. He's a warlord. Them Irish lot, they are serious, serious problems. <laughs> they are. They are. But my nephew will come good. Better to get those little experiences out of the way young rather than when he's on the crest of a wave. Like I just said to you earlier on in his thing, right? Is better when you, I would have got my first. I went into defeat, but when I got bruises, I felt so hurt. You think so high that it's a difficult game, all that man. It's easier said than done when you're watching from the sidelines. I'll tell you that, but I had my stick out and everything, man. Mm. That to warm me up to go and sit in the chair. <laughs> Good and Benny, you know what I mean? Uh, uh, uh. But I fell asleep on the train. It was a good night last night. Everybody was there, you know what I mean? But it was hard to take. When you've got people that you love, look, think about Mason Carter's dad, my big brother Al. He's got to sit there and watch all that. But for me, I, I don't like to see people that I love getting hurt. I wouldn't send my daughter on, far, on, on the sun on that into the ring. My grandson, even, he wants to be a fire. But I'm not going to go and sit there and go and watch him get hurt. I ain't going to do it. I swear to God. Yeah, man, always. I am MCFC of top form at the moment, as you have seen. Yeah? Out and about. This week we're going to mash it. I've got a couple of surprises for your mama. I'll get a good sleep tonight. I'm going to travel in a minute, get my head down, uh, eat some more food. Before. Yeah, I'm good. I know Golden, yeah. D, nice, my boy, always. Mama, behave yourself, man. So, Mason Greenwood, what news? What Mason Greenwood? I'm, like, I'm not talking about Mohammed, I'm not talking about, I'm talking about my nephew, Mason Carter, down in Gloucester. <laughs> Yeah, exactly, Clayton's. You see it, because you see it, you've got enough there for another go with that same person, you'll find it out, and I saw the fire. It was hurtful for me. I don't like it, personally. Neil, I cried, I cried, yeah, I cried. yeah, 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 but in the early days. Oh yeah, I'm coming with Brian in a minute. Everybody get in here, because I'm going to break down the facts. I'll leave it up to you lot. I know some of you lot, look at it, down in the northeast about my big brother, my sister Emma, down there. But Uncle Yanni points to the facts. And the facts will always remain to me. Why did Lee Worm, what's his name? He read Lenny McLean, Roy Shaw, Cliff Fields. You not believed in all that. You see what I mean? But when they talked about, when he said Brian, as far as he was concerned, was probably even greater. You lot are telling me, oh, no, 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 I don't believe that bit. So then that means everybody else that you think about, that means that throws there legacy into doubt, yeah, for the fighting game. Because whatever you brought to me over that time, nice one, Ziga, always biggie up down there, on my, right? Whatever you brought to me, because there's always gonna be haters for me, or I get haters as well, through my life and through who I've got contacts with, and uh, it's not even so much me, I know they just hate that I love other people, but let's be realistic about this. You still haven't brought anything to me that tells me that Brian Cockrell will spark out on the floor, right? Lee Duffy joined forces with him. Yeah, Garside, both those fights. JB, JD, loads of love. Yeah, no, I don't like that thing, my man. You lot taking a fucking piss. I don't believe it's Paddy Conroy. Me, Uncle Yami, I don't think Paddy, Paddy Conroy would steep that low. I think Paddy Conroy, all my information on Paddy Conroy, I know a lot of people close to him. I don't believe that Paddy Conroy would be doing all that. Yeah, all right, B, B, yeah. 
No, but, but it's not that kind of thing. All those fighters, they're like that. Either way, with Garside, they both stole each other when they weren't right. When they're taking drugs and they're out of their box, anything. I was down there. Remember I told you what happened the other day on the dodge interview? I was like, but if you come and start while you're not quite right, everybody can come and start. Um, Ray Hill said it the other day with certain things. The nice one, my boy. But, yeah, but, yeah, but, JD, who weren't a bully in that life, though? Who weren't a bully in that life, in that way? If you're a tax man, you're a bully. So what are you telling me? Brian Cockles already said that. The two golf side fights you talk about, they both stole it on each other when they weren't both right, Ron M. Come on, Ron M, let's bring the facts to the table then. So that league guy that wrote Lenny McLean, Roy Shaw, Cliff Fields, so that means if he said that Brian Cockrell was one of the greatest of all time in that life, so that means then, peace, man, man, behave yourself. I've got too much going on. <laughs> Listen. Yeah, but how? What is he meant to do? Take the law into his old, old thing. I saw the bike that Emma's got. I saw it. My sister's in there. So hold on a minute then. JD, is that what you're saying? It's all right to go around there while there's a woman in the house. Why not call him outside and have it out? He's a warlord. He'll still come out there and have a row. Phil Curry, loads of love. Uncle Phil, we love you. PJ, we still good about you last night. Just talk the facts. Don't talk shit. Tell me when you saw Brian Cockrell sprawled out on the floor. Knocked out. 70 years, 60 years. PJ, come on, man. I've got to come up here and bring it down to you. Yes, that was trade. Yeah, I'm so cool, Dale. So I'm so, such a good form at the moment, mate. We all got to dig deep. It's the game. You lot were the ones that signed up to the true crime thing. You lot are living out on the streets. You know what it all means. No one could ever get it right on every night. But I know one thing. You lot saying, yeah, but yummy yeah, with that and that, that one was better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But Brian Cockrell would still overpower you with his strength. <laughs> when you had him in the house, Exactly. I don't get it either. I agree with that, people. I don't understand all that stuff's put on YouTube. But what is he meant to do? He's got to cover his tracks. Just in case he's got to go. They're all going down there for him. There's people, I can tell you. Yeah, they'll strain. And not only that, Brian Cockle's an old veteran. He's got to think, well, hold on a minute. I ain't having this because I've got to protect my missus. So if anything comes out of this, because this one's coming from Ireland and that, what's his name? Um, you phoned me the other day. I said, listen, I, I, I don't know. All I know is I'll tell my people the truth. Yeah, United, you won that. You won that with you cuss away fresh. I'm going to have you soon, man. No, I'll tell you that. No, but in reality, Jay, um, LZ, what is he meant to do? He's got to cover his tracks. If he goes out there, they will come down and they start their little kids that they sent down by that from them, you know who. What, what is he meant to do? He's got to have a defence. They're the ones that brought it in public. They're not showing their face, so what difference does it all mean? Come on! You can't have it always. You can't. Yes, MCFC. Because you were the ones that are doing it, but you're not saying who you are. So if he wants to retaliate or something happens, he's got to cover his tracks. That's his house, that's his missus. We don't do women and all that. Sorry, mate. That's not the way that we live that life, man. Leave the man. You never said nothing. Why he was 40 odd and, and all that. That's what makes me laugh. I looked at people. I said, I'm, I'm Brian Cockrell. He's got his little injuries. Brian will still turn up outside there if you call him. Yeah, he would. Yeah, he would. Brian, he would. He would. He would. Brian would still turn up out there for his family. Yes, he would. To protect that. Sacred homes. We sleep. Is that the lowest form that you lot can go to down the men's? Mm -mm. Uncle Yammy don't agree with it. I looked at all the facts. I looked at everything. I looked at... Yeah, bang on. You see what I'm saying, Del? El, 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 come on, man. All right, I point to Keith Pringle, down North East. Let's look at the figures that I met over the years. Keith Pringle, Paul Ash, Weber, um, Chrissy Boyle, Darlene, um, Brian Swalby, Solby, Bath, right? The names are five or six, yeah? The Sayers, but... So, and then Jimmy, what's his name? Um, what's his name that wrote the book? Lee, but work, whatever his name. So that means then that everything they ever told me, that means that, we, if that means that they ain't got Brian Cockle, right? That means they ain't got everyone else, right? It's what one rule for one, run one, one rule for all. He knows. Paddy Conroy wouldn't do that. I don't believe so, man. 
I don't mind Paddy Connor. I don't get involved in the politics. Brian, Brian, when I say to Pat, when I say to Brian Cockle, listen, I don't mind Paddy Connor. Brian Cockle goes, Shabby, that's cool. That's your opinion. You, you do what you got to do. He's never tried to persuade me and try to change my view about Paddy Conroy or anything. But I don't believe it wasn't Paddy, man. It's not Paddy. Paddy ain't doing that with Paddy's old school. Uncle Yami knows I got history. Listen to me. I'm on form at the moment, man. I'm the girl with the sugar tree at the moment. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Miss, come on. Oh, go and get your head down, Shades, man. You're another muppet, mate. I ain't even got no time for none of you. I hate it because I'm better looking than you. <laughs> Do you know what he said, Lorraine? You're on Tim Fool, yeah, but yeah. That was about two months ago now. Get your head straight, mate. You want me to be. You can never be me. You hear me? You can't confront me. You ever come outside my house and go and throw anything in there? Yeah, you will see. You see that big fucking thousand bullet thing that will ride off your little head for you lot. You come and trouble me. Peter agreed. 100% Peter. Come and trouble me. You see me? Come. I won't do it their way. No, I won't. You know that. Yeah. I tell you that not straight. Don't play with me. No. Yeah. You hear me? Get me, Harry. <laughs> oh, don't play with me. I'm not on that. I ain't on that, mate. Don't come. If you come to me, yes. Oi, oi, that's fresh stuff, baby, love. John, yeah, we know this, my boy. Man. Jimmy White, my boy, where's my little girls? I love my little Katie. Where are you? Shades, what do you mean, you Shades? Oh, okay, Shades. Okay, sorry, 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 sorry. Yeah, David, I'm saying to you, yeah, but nah, man, you can't do it that way. But Shades, all said and done, I ain't taking that shit. I ain't, mate. I don't care, man. You want to bring that to Uncle Yami? I told you that the other day, you know, and I'm cool now. You remember, I've got over everything now, right? You know we're moving forward now. You know the game's well and truly on fresh, David Moore. You know I'm going into that book now. Everywhere I can go, I'm up and about. Those muscles are back on. But if you ever play with me like you played with my sister Emma, I will come out. I'll come at that front door there. Yeah. <laughs> And I will, follow, I will tell all of them, the police and the old Bailey, I will tell them, listen, what do you want me to do? I'm not going to sit here waiting for you lot to protect me. Are you dumb? Behave yourself with me. You know yourself. I'm not putting no trust in nothing. If you step into my arena and violate my space and my privacy and my family, you lot are out. Remember I told you that, man. If I go missing, you know what it means, man. I will be sticking up for myself. I know a lot of you will be in the courtroom watching the trial. Because <laughs> you know Uncle Yami, goody. Come, come on, man. Come on, Dave Lemo. No. It's not good. I'm not going to come up here and go, yeah, I'm going to go on YouTube and go do all that. I'll put it up. I'll go to the old Bailey and I'll be guilty. <laughs> Behave yourself. Behave yourself. Oi, El. <laughs> You know Uncle Yami, no wrong and strong. Right, right, right. They want to, so what do you want me? I'm not going to stand there and wait for you lot. I got, we all lived that life in the past, like Matt Legg said the other day. So we expect them to come out. But when you're doing all that to the MR, what are you, what you really saying? And send little kids around there and blah, 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 blah. You know what I mean? Just because, yeah, Daniel, oh, it's coming. Daniel, mm, don't play about it, Uncle Yami. I'm finding, I'm, I've worked three years of hurdles, Uncle Yami, finding, has a bit, but I'll keep it real. I'll keep it real, mate. Crosshatch, where you been, my boy? You've been hiding lately, yeah. <laughs> but on a real thing, though, real thing, I ain't gonna hide behind, no, I'm not gonna pretend to be nothing that I'm not. I will never harm an innocent victim ever again. I will never rob, steal, con, do anything to anyone. Yeah, Del? I know, but they're carrying feeling over that past life. Well, bring it to Brian. Bring it to Brian. Mark, bring it to Brian, mate. Bring it to Brian then. Come out, all right, Brian. Brian, one stick of leg, he'll turn up. Brian's a diehard. <laughs> but you can't do that, man. Every little creepy coward moves like that, man. Uncle Yummy's onto you. I swear down, man, because Emma, that missed her by inches. I said, don't think I ain't got the videos. Don't think I ain't got the photographs. Don't think I ain't seen what I need to see. 
It's a living coward's move, man. He is bothered. He is bothered. Don't worry about that. Don't, I don't care what Brian's got to say. He's bothered, man. Brian, my big brother, he's bothered, man. His missus is in the house. He's bothered. He is. He's bothered, mate. It's a muggy turnout, mate. It's ideal. Because that don't mean... That don't mean that. We'll go into the courtroom. We'll see who's right and who's wrong. Simple. Simple, then. Yeah, but... Yeah, but... Adam... He deserves it what way? Because whether he was a bad man back in the day, he's not telling anybody any different, uh, big brother. He ain't, is he? That's all of our lives that you watch on YouTube. Ex-criminals, reformed, that kind of tax man, robber, the jail, hit man. Da -da -da -da. What does it all mean then? What you, what's the point in watching then? We've all got to have enemies from the past. Doesn't really matter, does it? I know, Dean. I got you, my boy. All you got to do is message me on Messenger. Yeah, nice one. Oh, Vin, uh, Viv, cool, Vin, cool, cool, cool. No, because the latest I'm hearing, um, Goody, with the latest third attack. Fuck it, they'll through the window the same way. Is yeah, but yeah, but Nick. Yes, but then what does that tell you? To me, it hits the facts home. Because that means you lot are carrying so much feeling in his younger days. You're waiting till you get to his older days to do what you have to do. That tells me then that his story throws even more ammunition to make it right. I can't think of it any other way. And even worse than that, you're still not turning up and calling him and calling him out on the high road. So that don't mean nothing to me. Peter Green, you've got to keep it real, mate. You know what I mean? No missing. No missing from Uncle Yanni, man. Wales, Wales, we love you, Medusa. In it, Medusa. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying. You know, Brian will stand up to the end. You know, he gets irritated because he doesn't, he gets frustrated because he thinks, but it bothers him, man. If his missus is in there, it bothers him, mate. Yeah, it does. Of course it does, mate. Yeah, man. Oh, do you? Yeah, yeah, like of us. Anyone changing if everyone's got what they deserve. Yeah, but it's, it's like a boss. Gunshot. John Boy Cowboy. Gunshot like a boss. So disappointing. Because I know my wrongs so might not be half as bad as some of theirs on the outside, but what about the inside for me? Yeah, man, King B, love you, Mark, my lover. But I accept it. I still got to go like that. I know I'm expecting you. You know what I mean? I ain't going to rest on my laurels. I've never rested on my laurels in there. You know what I mean? Brian Cocker was the same. He's got to expect that. When you're bringing it to the house, behave yourself. Behave yourself. Yeah, Dean. Come and get in touch, boy, because you know I'm winning at the moment, son. I'm in the right place to give you that kind of advice. Gary Lineker. <laughs> I liked him. You know, Lineker! 1-0! I used to like him. I, I loved his finishing, especially when he was at Tottenham. Trust me, and England. Mm. Yes, Jason Armstrong. Love. Love to my sister Lorna and I swear my little niece Bodie. <laughs> JJ, I love you, my boy. Nah, man, Fury beats him. Fury can't use that. Where's he going to go after that? Yeah, Sasha, Sasha, top four. You meant to know. You've been watching me like, how are you? You've got some days under your belt, Sasha. Yeah? Is that continued? Let me know, my boy. Let me know, Sasha. Go by on you, you know. Sean Fowler, nice. Yo. <laughs> Sean Fowler, where you been, boy? I ain't seen you for a while. Goody. He's going to knock him out, man. Is that you, Rev? Scott, my boy, you know, family Scott, you know, he's been there for me, Scott, boy. I'll tell you, Scott, we're reaping the rewards now, though. Uncle Yami finally delivers the longest period since I've been out clean off drugs to drink now and again when I've gone out. Still been a little bit of a problem. I can't call on complete um, clean time yet. My behaviour changes a bit funny on the drink. It gets a bit football hooligan I'm monitoring it, but Uncle Yami is going to deal with that too, if you get what I mean. Yeah, it was, no, it was cool. I'll stay cool there because all the people. <laughs> but the night before, the night, the week before that, when I, it, my behaviour. Yeah, oi, Sean, I love you, boy. Yeah, yeah. Oh, t t tough, tough, tough. We've got you too. I love, I love Gascoigne. In 90, he was the greatest. Don't ever worry about that. I'll tell you that straight up and down, mate. He lost, man. He lost, MC. He lost, but it was a funny, it was a learning curve. But he'll be back. 
Yeah, yeah, Danny Christian would have that about right. Danny knows his stuff. He knows a bit more about the fight if you know me. Del, yes, my boy. Yeah, no, it's Scott. We know it. Is. We know what Yabby is. <laughs> no, we bring the real game to the table. No bollocks from Uncle Yami, man. 100%. Um, you can't. Where's it going to go, Em? You can't. you got to go. Tyson Fury's in the cell himself. But I can't see that. I can't see that. He was. In the, and you got to see it, the Mars Bar kid, when he was doing all that and all that. But I, I was with Jimmy Ozzy and Downsville. I watched that World Cup final. Gaza was magic, mate. Against the Dutch, against everybody. He was a man. I, yeah, but I run. That's what, I don't rest on my laurels, you know. You know what I mean? You know, I, mean? I might have got over all the substances and that, my boy. I still want to go out and have lived some life. I'm hyperactive and want to shake a leg and dance. But I've realised a drink could be, might be worse than most, maybe all of it. Because everything does something different to me, King B. Yeah, because that's it. That's it, King. You know, it's that bit. He can't do, can he? He can't do. Because you know, you can't. You've got to win now, but there's no place to go. No rematch is going to make no difference whatsoever. 100%. Give you the facts there. But no, 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 no. Danny Cassie will have that man right. Really. Because Jake Paul is not, he's gonna have a row, but is it? I love I in fact I love that curry goal. That makes me strong, you know. In the Ivan. Oh no, no, I Ivan can't be a draw. He can't come back with nothing left in the lockout, man. Is it, Sasha? Oh, Sasha. I know what that feels like. You get in touch with me if you need me. Uncle Yabu will give the secrets to the game. So the, the light bulb going off in his little head and say, but hold on a minute. There's no point in doing that lot because that's going to mess up your delivery, your looks and your personnel and your character. Yeah, I mean, all right, if you want to go and shake a leg and party, you missed out on 40 years, go and dance with all the birds and, you know what I mean, go in there and, you know what I mean, love everybody, but even that can be a problem as well. You know what I'm saying, girls, you know what I mean? We go through the journey now, we're on the last bit. Do I see the error of my ways with that too? Wow. Because it could still be problems, but yeah. I'm, I, you know what I found with the dream? It's only, I only got problems when I'm on my own. When I'm around proper people, I behave myself. But I do get a bit excited, man. You know what I mean? It's, it's deep in it, this life, man. You know what I mean? You want to go out, you want to show, but it can get you into, all of it can get you into trouble. But I missed out on so much. I want to, you, you, it's like a new lease of life. You want to go out. Yeah, hey, it's a bit more, ha, <laughs> damn. <laughs> is it, is it, oh, yeah, Tom, don't make me laugh, yeah. Yeah, well, yeah, man, of course, man. I'm down there soon, you know. I'm going to go and see my author down there as well. He's down in Wales. I'm going to get the book started, you know. I'll start doing little chapters here and then we big up Simon and his family, uh, Julie, and everybody down there. I love you dearly. The time they were patient. Everybody's been patient for me. That Dodger interview, I really enjoyed it. That was, you notice I was too hyperactive, but I done Colin McIntyre's interview. That was the early stages after <laughs> the adrenaline was too hyper. But now, time steadies on. We get better and better and cooler, more back to normal. Is it? Is it, Nick? I didn't know that. I didn't know that, you know. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Nah, I didn't know that. But nah, man. Nah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they were the days. <laughs> they were the days. Don't let me laugh. But no, let's be real about all this. They're always running, talking about... Is that you, JS? Big up, my boy. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. I couldn't have his own song at the moment. <laughs> but listen, let me tell you something. Let's get the story straight. Brian Cockle exactly said what he wants. He wants redemption. He does it the way he does it. All right, he's doing something with his life now. He's a straight guy. He wants... Are you... Are you M? I know, thanks, Scott. Yeah, oh, yeah MCM. MCF there. Yeah, but... It, it depends what you mean by lying to of. Lied once, twice, exaggerated, misconcepted. Got it wrong about the dates and the times and who it was. He's older now. When you're recollecting, we've seen with Uncle Yami, sometimes I come up there and get it wrong. What date was it again? Was it that bit or was it that bit? You can't. You can't penalise him for that. You can't have 75% of the stories and 20% and then you go, oh yeah, but that means he's a proper liar. That's his brain. He's been through scarred. He's traumatised as well. No, but it's off. Come on. He's still traumatised. Now in later life. Really? King. 
Yeah, I know people say that about Benjamin. No, it's not. Benj. Yes, yes, Tom Bowdy. Leo, where you be, Lee? Hayley, Hayley, phone me tonight or tomorrow. I'm, I'm, I've got four, four to do this week. Yeah, but Lee Duffy still teamed up with him. He had his sister. Where, where do we draw the line? Yeah, but there was this little geezer in Hartlepool. We put it on him. Oi, <laughs> oi, Lois, you too, my boy. You know, people put it on me. It depends how you felt on the day, of it? You were like that. All right, I'll leave that. I'll come back for you tomorrow, mate. I ain't in the mood for that. Now, he might have had a smoke. <laughs> he might have been para. <laughs> Who's that, Bob? Lovely to hear from you, Bob. So, yes, but what day means what? Yeah, I'm going, I might be doing part two with that one. There's a story coming up right now. Yeah, I might, I might be going James English as well. Yep, yeah, I'll be doing Ricky Keeling too. I'll be going on a few of them. And my boy, Billy Moore. That's going to be a good one. Me and Billy's personalities. I love Billy's style, you know. He's a bit, he's a, when he mentioned me the other, because he's a bit of a cheeky chappy on the sly, you know, Billy. But no, Billy was a cheeky chappy. I like the way he tells his little, you know, he's so real as well. Uncle Yami likes that. He likes that. No, but <laughs> I like the way he brings all that in. You see it? Yeah. I met him twice. I met him when he was a kid. When he was about 10 years older than me, I met Paul Allen, Lee Ashton, Haya, um, all them, all them lot. They was in the cat A's with me, but all them, the early bits with um, Paul Allen, they were kids. And then I saw him, but that, that don't mean that he's my best friend or blah, blah, blah. You know what I mean? I never said that. I said, the few words were exchanged. Da, 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 da. Scott, nice. Mark Epstein, I met light skin, big. Mark Epstein was with me and Danny Kelly. Mark Epstein was with me in the holding cell. What about this then? All right, all right watch this. Uncle Yami, gunshot. He was in the holding cell in Belmarsh, right? I was going to meet Conan the Barbarian, my little young friend I used to wrestle with all the time. Conan's got, Yami, yeah, you're strong, you know. He's a big geese of Conan. That's Mark Epstein's boy. Am I lying? Yes or no? No, am I lying? That's my boy Conan, Danny Kelly. He was in the cell with me for nine months. Behave. Uncle Yami knows. Yeah, but no, you know, we've got that collection. I would know how to deal with that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Is it? Let me know. No, Lois. And what? Danny Kelly was in the cell with me for nine months. Danny Kelly was my boy. I used to wrestle with him. He's a young, they were all younger than me at some stage in that life. Conan, when I left Mark Epstein, in Belmarsh, he was in the change, he said, Yami, when you go to Loudon Grange in 99, 2000, my boy's there's Conan. I said, Conan, he was in Swellside with me. My boy, I love Conan, you know, he's proper stuff as well. He said, Yams, he used to let me win the wrestle sometimes. He's strong, isn't he? <laughs> he used to let me, boy. Conan was my boy. I know about Lee Murray. You, that's stupid. Now we're, the, we're gonna get to the nice on Hong Kong. Let me just go because you know I'm a right off. Come on, don't behave yourself with me. Exact like have I got it right? Light skin, wide, did it? Yeah, yeah, I mean, did it? He said, yeah, I mean, when you go down there, when you go down there. By that time, I really saw Lee. Kim Farry as a cage fighter, Jimmy Manola from Croydon. They were 15 and 16 when I met them. I was 30 something, and they were bringing me. They would get me to. What's up with these people, man? They're tough. Get behave yourself. Who you talking to? I could hear me, Austin, loads of love. Exactly, Austin. Got me, Taff. Hong Kong. Thomas O'Rourke was my boy. I just had to look after him, you know, Dale. Because he couldn't read and do the applications because, you know, he gets temperamental. You remember the Parkhurst riots when he came from there? They, they was all mash-up prints and matches and all that during that riot. And Parkhurst, I saw them after that. They all got scars over that, yeah? Exactly. Oh, Benjamin. But because until such a time when my brain's really clear and I could call them dates, places, times, who's linked to who. Then we bring, because remember, sometimes it's cloudy when I'm down. We know what it means. Did it, Lois? Don't we know it? Those are the facts, my boy. Nah, they're not gonna test Charlie Talk, but the danger is Charlie might test himself. It's deep, you know, when people are coming out. You've got to keep that real. Yes, Lois, yeah. In it, oh, Paul, don't let me start. 
Yeah, nah. I can call on people and when you ask them, they're going to go, yeah, that bit's right, yeah, nah, did, he did, Uncle Yanni, that was that. Yeah, 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 I did see him, it went like that, I did say that to him, blah, 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 oh, gunshot, John Boy. You see it? Yes, yes, I'm, yeah, no. I'm K West, proper, I know he's my boy, I keep saying I'm Lois, you know, but I know it's K West. But Danny Kelly was my boy, K West. And um, Mark Epstein only met him once or twice. Conan was my boy. They're all from that neck of the woods. Paul Allen, he's proper stuff, mate. He got shot recently. Uncle Yummy. But Lee Russia, he's proper stuff. It's my boy too. They all are at some stage during my life. They all had to call for some stage in life. Uncle Yummy. At some stage, at some point. Yeah. But Epstein, I didn't know him like I mean Conan. But I remember that bit when he sent me down there. He said, "Yeah, please." Da, 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 da. Right, that was in 2000. No, 99, 2000. He was doing a free, yeah, and he was finishing off. Did he? Tell me more. It's a bit, Nick, Nick, Nick. It's a bit cloudy sometimes when I'm not right. But don't miss about it. It's all coming back. There's more. There's more. K West is coming. There's more coming up here. You know, it's like muscle memory, yeah? you got brain memory too, yeah? It's a Welsh side, isn't it, Tom? We love my Welsh. Where's Kelly Davis? I'm worried about she's ill as well. Where's Tara Sean C, all my angels down there in Wales. Um, Carl Samuel, Stuart Wells, they're my people. Gary Griffin and his missus. Stevie Wonder. Would you want to know, Stevie? Would you want to know, mate? K West. Oh, we haven't brings the facts to the table. Anything? If I didn't get it right, I'd always come up and say, I've got that bit wrong. I got a bit confused. I'll take it down. Simple. The game's hotting up now. I'll be raising the bar. I told you a few weeks ago that that's, this is the final comeback with drugs. You know that I'm not going to bring myself down. Yeah? Right? So, no, don't turn. Yeah, yeah, please. Yeah. Right? Yeah, but he done that. He done what's his name? He done what's his name? I'm Grace, my girl, man. I love you, man. Where's Sam Brooks? I love you too, you know. Annie Tree, my angels from way back in the day. River Blue, we all love you, man. We even big up Gang Gang down here, even though she's gone the other way now. Shades. No, Shades, I, I think I understand what you mean now. Everyone's entitled to their opinion. You always respect Uncle Yami's opinion. I say to you, from the Northeast, that I believe that Brian Cockrell was one of the greatest all time. When they had him in the house and they was beating him, you, he quite clearly says he was in real, real trouble. They come to kill him, but he still managed to get up and get out. You know what I mean? Think about it. You know what I mean? Yes, JC Kemp's nice one, boy. It, oi, oi, kick. But it's, it doesn't work for me, does it? It doesn't work, does it? It don't. It's better. It's it don't. With health grounds, the past, history, the brain, my supporters, the families. I need to be at my best for you all. Get ready, you know? I'm telling you, London shadows. Mm, my boy. No, K West. I'm not playing, you know? I told you. We're going to find out. I'll be getting some deep sleeps. I'll be dreaming, man. Yeah, but tough. You've got to say it on what bit, my boy, is he lying about? One thing, two thing. He got a wobble here, he put one here. What, 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 what? People get confused, man, in later life. <laughs> but Toff, is it enough to book him as his life, as it, it was? You know what I mean? Because if it wasn't... No, but Toff, you, just, you do what you've got to say, man. You're my boy, you're my people. At the same time, you're just giving your thing. No, but at the same time, bring someone then. Where did they do him then? Garside? That everybody agrees in the northeast, both parties when they swung at each other weren't quite right that night. All of us know there were many times in that life where we weren't quite right. I weren't quite right the other day. <laughs> I didn't told you not the half of it yet. Yeah, but Tyson Fury was giving his respect to them and laughing and thinking, Yeah, but I idolize you. Tyson's like that, he's godly, he's gonna go like that, he's gonna go, Listen, no, nah, everything cool. All right, Mike, say we got to say, man. I, I, don't, I, I looked up to you. He keep that in his mind like the way that I do with certain people. It's the game. He keeps it real to himself, Tyson Fury. Don't mess about with his little games and his mental spins that he does like Muhammad Ali. Don't watch that. That's entertainment and that's media. That's not his real person. His real personnel, I'll tell you what's fun, is forgive me, Lord, because I have sinned. Yeah? You got it, K-West. You got it, T.O. You got it, my boy. And wait, 
Again, the Deontay Wilder fights, you can't tell me they weren't world-class performances. Trust me, that's a warlord standing there. From the first fight, he never trained for a couple of years. He went in there with his little big bit and got a draw and then he got sparked out. He made amends for those last two fights. He come out and said, boy, I know you could knock out everybody. The bomber is one of the greatest punchers of all time. I told you like that. Many say that, right? He went out there and met fire with fire. Who else did that? No one else ain't beat Wilder like that. Behave. Look at the facts. Unless I'm reading from a different set of glasses. You got me. Tyson Fury is the dog. When he has to, he will. He plays about. I love his character. I do. I can recognise. We all fall short glory. Don't make tell me Tyson Fury is lying about that. You well done, T.O. You know my boy, man. But he, he go in. He will dig in and he will find it. Look into those eyes when he was standing there looking at Wilder. Listen, I'm going to have you tonight. Boy. He, I bet you it is. He is, mate. No matter what they want to say on that, he's playing about with it. He's six figures. He's giving him a leg up and all that. He's just going to say, yeah, because he's got. He's not going to be big enough. He ain't. He ain't. He ain't. He ain't. Well, I've I'm wrong, of course. But you was hit by faith. Well done, private, my boy. My son's as always time exactly. Repeat. My boy, man. Yeah, man. Elsin. <laughs> Oi, Elsin. That's what they were calling me the other day. Charlton Leicester when he was dead. At the end, you remember they put him on the horse? I, I liked to Sophia Loren. You remember that, Elsin? And they put him on a horse, but he was dead. But because they wanted to make it look like he can't die, he can't die. In the biblical days, everybody started running. They won the war. <laughs> yeah, man. Del Strain. Yeah, 100%. 100%, my boy. 100%. Don't worry, my boy. But yeah, cracking life, cracking life, man. You know what I mean? Anything else I bring to the table. You know what I mean? Do they? What else is it? My brother's ma, oh, don't make me cry. I saw Alistair. Alistair's in touch with me, you know. My school don't make me laugh. Robert, I know it's you now. Roy and Marco. My boys, where are they? I want to do an interview with them. They know me better. El Cid. I know! Oh, gonna suss that! I am. I'll, do, I'll be back to that. As soon as I get over this little shaking a leg every few days to be with the crowd and I'm excited being back to normal, the great Yami B, the chest is back. When I get over those little drink, because when I do my stuff, I want to do it proper. But then nobody came with <laughs> You know what I mean, my boy? Yeah. You know what I mean, Kay West? When we get over that little bit there, yeah, I never like to do things without a proper heart, man. I tried all that, man. JC. Don't like that, you boy. See, I know, I know, I know. T.O., amen. You see what I mean? I work it, you work it out as the journey goes on. You go up there, you're clean for two weeks, you do the readings, adjust for today, we do the Bible readings, but you're not actually, you're doing well at that time. It's not long enough. You're not spiritually in, in, you know, intact like you would be if you've got a month or two, and then you can deliver to the people that need it properly, that appreciate the voice that the Americans are after and the TV stations. I know there's a couple more of them things up now. I've got to bring some more to say, Steve Jones, Stephen Jones. You my boy, remember that? We keep it real to the better end. You know, you got that. Oh, it's Stevie Wonder. They're dead, didn't they? You know, if I raise the bar, they're all out. You and I knew that. Paulie, Paulie boy, Darren, my boy. Why are you all coming in? That yeah, take care, everyone. You as my people. Remember that. The game's rising now. No going back for Uncle Yami. Nothing to bring me down, man. I know the sleep's getting deeper, the big's getting big, but I've been getting excited a little bit. I've been getting a little bit excited. And I realise even having a couple of drinks here and there can still be a downfall for a man. Tio. Because yeah, anytime, Tio, you get in touch with me, my boy. You know my followers come first. Yes, yeah, Simon, my boy. You no, know, JC, we know that. We know God played a part in that too, my boy. Yeah, man. God, oh, hey, JC. I thought I was crying the other day. It was deep for me. I know. I was talking to Glenn Howard and he brought it all back to me. How I was feeling when I was talking to Paul, Paul H. I was like that in the morning. He was making me remember. Yeah, I mean, remember what I did? Remember, it's me. I was in tears. I was going, I can't talk now. I can't talk. It gets overwhelming for me because I know he looked after me, man. Those are the facts, man. You lot knew this. We knew that I'd get over that stuff. It was touch and go. Like I said on Dodger's interview, it was real. I was in serious trouble. And then I said, you know what? I ain't hurting myself that way there. Let me get over this little period now then. What are we talking? 
when we're talking game set and match. But I remember this, you know. Never hate Trevor. Lo loads of love, my boy. Goldfinger. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But Jason, you got it, my boy. It's a deep, deep life. I keep you that third voice. I get the child's voice. That Lowe's star I was talking about. Yami, what about the inner child? Sammy talks to me. I get tearful. It's very, very deep, this life. You know, I'm scared sometimes, man. That's uh, because I do. Yep. Yeah, I know. I know what you mean, Neil. I know. Yeah, man. Yeah, Benjamin, man. Lies up the biggest guy. Yeah, man. He got to. I'm telling you, he knows the intention, what's in your heart, what you did. I know, MMA, I love you, my boy. The game's on, you know, MMA. They're all in trouble soon. The studio's coming. Everybody's been waiting for me, but I only knew I wasn't ready. So I had to go through all this shit. You saw it with your own eyes. It's hard. Rip my head. Deep. Deep. But one thing I did in those three years, I've never committed no crime. You know what I mean? Behaviour problems and demons aside and what we feel about ourselves, the self-esteem, that kind of stuff. And when you're isolated, when you bump into risky people, risky places, and you get hurt. You're <laughs> Simon. But I don't know if I can... I'll, I'll get round to you, though. I know. I right, tap, 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 my boy. Cool, 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 cool. But you know what? I love you all dearly. I ain't playing about my crowd's a different thing. The source thing, man. Yeah, source, call me, whatever. I, I, I'm with you on that. Darren, I believe that my man Mayweather was the greatest of all time. That's Uncle Yummy. I don't care. The sweet science. I'll give you that fact today. Yo, da, where you there? Where's Yamaha? He played a part in my recovery. He said, Yami, listen, forget all that's light work for you. Yeah, Yamaha spots it. Uh, he knows you don't know me good. You know I've got what it takes to blow them all out of the water. They can't freelance like me. You have to script things, edit things. I don't have to do that, and I ain't even been mentally right. They rang me the other day, the BBC, this is a... Uh, yeah, I mean, let me tell you something. You see, when you're ready, they all have to take a back seat. Jack Jones. I've got that, Jack Jones. Don't worry, man. I was down there. The big man was down there. Us. He was deep. I love him so dearly. All them from Manchester. They was all in there. They were saying, yeah, I mean, listen, I love you. You did. Yeah, oh, it was emotional for me, man. Yes, man. Kate Westman, I love you, man. That story. He was my boy. At least got that win yesterday. I was so happy. I'll tell you that straight up and down. But I ain't Paul Cheshire. Mayweather. No. He knew. And he, whatever. You know what I mean? Come on. You know I know. Nah. Yeah. 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 Yeah, man. I'll tell you what. You're not going to find out. But you lot that stayed with me from the start. MAA. Tom, I'm a boy, I love you. Tom, listen, Manchester, we love you, that source. Yeah, oh, you say that, I miss that source. Listen, let me say something. You lot that stayed with me and that believed in me because you knew that I had the full artillery. You know who we are, Victor B. I hope you're getting better soon. Trace a face, I cry every night for you, right? My nephew, Jay Rock, everybody. Quincy, my boy, Tony Hodgson, Lisa, and my sisters. So I'm the great JG down there, Manchester Inquirer. It was my boy from the start. Dave Gunn, I love you. Matt Leggy was proper, right? All of them, what? James English, he was my boy. All of them, right? Central Club, all of them. Billy Moore, everyone at Atwood. All of my done business, what everybody's got with each other. Uncle Yami kept it real right to the end. Keep it real with Brian Cockrell, you know? You know what I mean? Look, you can't pick on a man when he's going getting older. That don't make it. If you're going to do that, go for the dawn, the high noon dawn on the high road, if it means that. He'll have the final stand with you. Remember that. I told you that, man. This game, there's no winners. We've got to live with our past. They're going to be coming back. I could go out there today. It could be all over with Darren Bottle, my boy. I could be, but I know. I ex that's the first thing I think about. With normal people, it don't really bother me. You can swear at me, slap me, box me. I'm not fighting you back. But you lot, from the past, with your little skeletons and the way that you do it, you come for me, you're out. <laughs> or I'm out. It don't matter to me. Because as far as I'm concerned, I'm protecting myself. You hear me, my people? But you lot that stayed with me, T.O. Lois, Lo you lot that believed in me for the next stage of the journey that I wouldn't get over working out behaviours and chip prison behaviour like Yamaha says and touching this and going on that and isolating and looking rough and, and then you can't give up because that's what I'm, that's the only game that I knew. But, 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 but you, son, who they were chatting to? Yeah, but you, son. You wouldn't think Uncle Yami's going to work it all out in the end. 
and come with a voice and a delivery for all subjects. You chatting to and bring in all walks of life and give everybody a chance. All you lot that stayed with Scott, you was my boy as well. Listen, let me tell you something. I'm not doing no talking, big talk thing. You know that I got this now, right? You lot that stayed with me and believed Trevor Briddle, you get everything from me. You hear me? I never wanted nothing out of my life from that past. I want my, I want my, what I want of that source. You know that, JB, J, J, yes, he was my boy too. John Porter, John Powell, all of you, right? My boys down there, Reese and Teresa and all them that stuck by me all them years. Let me tell you something. Remember I told you, I never wanted nothing. All I would do is look after everybody because it doesn't mean that I want to get paid for my abilities in other avenues, which I've got. That's not that's without question. No, Genghis Khan, just bring the table. Where's Mario Birdie? Where is he anyway? Paul H, he was my boy too. And I'll tell you that, they have to take a back seat with Uncle Yami. When I had to call it on in the cat age when I was down and pretending to sleep and come out, they went charging out the doors, Lewis Ferguson, Lee Gray. You know what we're talking about here? Yeah? Paul Fernandez, you was my boy too. JJ, you're my boy. Your family. What did you think it all meant? It's up to me in the end. And God, you have to treat yourself proper. You know what I mean? And then we go, we go that bit further. We could have never got it right after all them years being institutionalised. But remember I told you, I'm not on a play for Peter Hills. You was my boy as well. One of the realists out there. Always been there for Uncle Yami. Tony Gil Martin, my boy too. You was there for me. From creation, you believe, you said, you know what, one of those days, Uncle Yami's going to work it all out and then you've got to run because you don't have to practice and got to do what you've got to do. Uncle Yami can come up and freelance anything with a straight head. You're all dead and buried. You're not in my league. Yes, Genghis Khan, you on that big horse. I'm him too. I'm Charlton Eston and El Sin. I'm Ben Hur, Charlton Eston. <laughs> James Finch, JC Kevin, what? Benji, 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 Benji. Paul X, Paul Cheshire, you was my boy too. You remember that? I'll tell you that. Remember, I talk big and I come because you know that I know now. You know that I know not what to do. Don't bring myself down. Come. I've got a lot of people to help, mate. I've got a lot of Benji. <laughs> that story. I've got a lot of people to help because I'm a lover of people. I want people to be all right before me. If you lot are all right, then I'm all right. You know what I mean? Don't get conned by all that stuff out there. Get out <laughs> You knew that. You all knew that. Not really for Uncle Yami. Go behave yourself, man. They're going to come and tell you soon about two murders in jail. But don't listen to it. They never got charged. I went caught once they dropped the charges. Not Uncle Yami. It weren't me. They might come up soon and say, yeah, but he's done this and that. And that. I've never talked about it because I don't need to. It wasn't Uncle Yami. All right? No convictions, no nothing. One in the 80s, one in the 90s. But it wasn't me. So when it comes up, if they think they're being smart and they want to scandal Uncle Yami, Uncle Yami will tell you, I've got the court papers, all the things that transmit the bit of thing. The prison staff was on me. Get ready for that explosive thing as well. <laughs> but it wasn't me. I never got convicted. It went on, one of them, I went to court on the day, da -da -da, and they dropped it. Right? It was a prison, it was all here saying, Tom, 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 oh, I know you know already, anyway. Yeah, we don't know. It wasn't Uncle Yami. But, like we said, leave people's misses and children alone. Leave people's houses alone. If you're a big man and you went through that life, yeah, and you went through that life, yeah, you leave people's things, you be a man and go and call that on, man. You don't do all that. You want some psychological work. That's what I used to do in the cat A's and pray on, you know, yeah, I'm yeah, I mean, yeah, you better give me this, otherwise I'm not going to be on your side. And it's wicked, wicked things to do. Pray on people. One thing I never did in my crimes, though, was psychologically and brutally, sadistically harm people, right? Oh, don't, 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 no retreat, no surrender. Robberies, burglaries, the diamonds, yeah, the robberies with a gun, running up and down like a lunatic, frightening people. I still manage cowards, Medusa. Yeah, man. You see what I'm saying? Leave it alone. Leave it alone. Call it on. Call it on, man. You know what I mean? I will take that. I will take certain things. Yeah, man. Genghis Khan. I'm just looking at some other messages going through. But now, nah, man. Uncle Yummy's in a good place. I love it all dearly, right? So that's 54 minutes. Damn it, it hurts, isn't it, Gav? Come on, man. King of the jungle. Do you think they all got there and they say all that? You could call me and scandalise me and say, yeah, it was this, it was that, because you've got little carry little feelings. You can't say who you are. But at the end of the day, in the jungle, never to be questioned. 
by anyone. We pick up Razor Smith, we pick up Andrew Pritchard, we pick up my sister Sally Singleton, we pick up everybody tonight. And most of all, I pick up all of you lot. I love you dearly. The game is well and truly on now. I love you, Nicole. What a lie, boy. What a lie. But remember what I told you. Be careful what you hear out there. Many of you lot that are with me don't don't really suffer bollocks. <laughs> they know what's what. They said, but yeah, but this bit's bullshit and all. <laughs> you lot were smart. I'd be Irish as well. They all know them Irish because they're different. Mo, we love you. Jammers too, you know. Don't forget that David Warren, he was my boy always, you know that. But they know because they done bird. They experience. They, when they hear bullshit, they go like, huh? I can't listen to no bullshit. Yami gets it wrong sometimes when he's not right-minded. But when Uncle Yami's spitting the truth, they know. You know why they know? George Devlin, my uncle. Marina! My sister. Yeah, my other sister, Jay, my real sister as well. Yeah, Marina, I love you. And I'll pick up the father, Mick, as well. One time, father, Mick, will come up here too and talk about everything. Don't worry about that as well. Austin, my boy, I love you. JC, everybody, Stevie Wonder, I know I'm on one. It? <laughs> but listen to me. Remember that I told you, the truth will always prevail. When you go up there and you want to be the big I am and do this and I was that and I was all that, always remember your place in this thing because when you're talking, there's nobody to verify your stories. Those are the facts. You've got to have 10, 20, 100 people that can go, yeah, that happened and this happened before you go up there and you say them things. That's why you've all fall, fallen short of the game. I bring up the big men in Manchester, as usual. Him down there in Liverpool from last night too. I bring up Al Carter, my lovely nephew, nephew. You'll be back in this game. You hear me, Jonathan? 100%, my boy. I know you're watching. I know you're watching. I know they know that the time's coming, that the game's going to soon be on, where everybody gets a bit of everything. We get this professional bit. I knew that I wasn't ready. You hear me? Fact, JS, yeah. Because the real people will always know and they'll see right through you. They think, ah, hey, listen, well, you think you're getting a view off me just for bollocks and all that. I'd rather be vulnerable and I, my part in things and say my right place in things so that I know that when I'm talking, if you come in front of me, I'll be able to say, yeah, but hold on. I was with you. You didn't say that to me. He was there. He was there. Let's see what they got to say then. Huh? Yeah? Not, yeah, it was like this and it was like that. Remember I told you, you know, the game. Remember, God's watching. Those are the facts. I love you.